Welcome to our interactive pool. This is where we're gonna take an opportunity to introduce you to some of these sharks. No barrier at all. As in there's a shark in here. We're gonna have a seat and we're gonna put these things on your lap. That sounds like a horrible idea, let's do it. It's meal time for the sharks and I'll be providing the main course, which is, I hope, not me. This is Lily. Hi Lily. This is Lavender. She is about two years old. There is a shark in my lap. <laughs> this is absolutely incredible. Zebra sharks are a fantastic ambassador for sharks. One thing we have to talk about here, these animals are called zebra sharks. They are covered in spots. It does feel like there's something wrong with that. So what you're looking at is the adult coloration of a zebra shark. Uh -huh. When they're young, they have dark, and white bands that run vertically up and down their body. As a matter of fact, you can see the remnants of these bands oh, yeah. still in their body in their adult coloration. The idea is that they'll be eating out of my hands and not eating my hands. So if you want to take this Humboldt squid piece right here, sure. drag it ahead of her like this, okay. and you might feel her pull it out. Okay. I'm going to bring her right up to your squid. Unbelievable. Just like that. Yeah, it's like a vacuum. It is, yeah. And let me just check, one, two, three, four, they're all here. Well done. Fortunately, these sharks are more hungry for surf than turf. Do you get the sense that they like being petted? Like, do they take, like, is it like a dog where they, they sort of enjoy it? Like, it's hard to say what, what animals like, because we don't talk animal. But when given the choice to get scratches on their nose or not, they get the scratches on the nose. That's so, so weird to me that sharks are into like snuggling. If you look at the natural uh, behavior of these animals, they're known to root around. So they're accustomed to getting stimulus on their rostrum. Who doesn't like stimulus on their rostrum? <laughs> Despite the fact that sharks in general have a reputation for attacking people, it turns out that the danger is the other way around. Now, zebra sharks are endangered, right? Zebra sharks are. They have been fished out, uh, both for food, for fins. Right. What we're trying to do now is manage their reproduction so that we can reintroduce them to the world. That's incredible. That is so cool. This experience like completely upends what most people think about when they think of sharks. They are much more imperiled out in the wild from us than we are from them. Absolutely breathtaking.